you are gonna be doing um, for the next couple of weeks while you're at home until we get back from Thanksgiving break. So the first thing is I've sent out a video already explaining what to do this week, but just as a review, you are going to do 20 minutes of software every day and 20 minutes of independent reading each day. At the end of the week, you're gonna submit your logs. If you had paper logs at home already, you're gonna take pictures of those and upload them to me. Otherwise, I've given you digital links for you to use in order to upload those for Friday. So those logs are due on Friday. Next week, we're going to change up our schedule a bit, um, which is going to be something um, we're going to try to see how you do because I want us to continue on um, with the lessons we had scheduled. So the way that our new schedule is going to work is on Mondays and Tuesdays, we're going to be doing a whole group lesson, just like you would for most of you when you're in class with me. The way that's going to work is you are going to actually get onto a Zoom call with Mrs. Rice. And if you get onto the Zoom call, it will be worth bonus. So anytime that you log onto the Zoom call, while it is live, you will be getting some bonus that'll go towards your grade. When you're on the Zoom call, I would highly recommend that you attend because Mrs. Rice is going to actually go through the workbook pages that you will be completing for that day. So if you go through them with Mrs. Rice, you are actually going to get the answers right then. You'll have it completed and you can submit it right away and be done with your work for the day. So we are going to have those Zoom calls on Monday and Tuesday at 8.30 a.m. I will send a link out to you and you will see in my Schoology agendas, which I'm going to show you here in a minute, um, that there is a link in here as well. So you'll have lots of ways to access this. If you are unable to get onto the Zoom call or do not get onto the Zoom call, it will be recorded and then you can go look at the video as well later in order to help you. Or if you miss something during the actual live call, you can actually go back and look at that as well. When we are done, we're going to have at least one thing that's due every single day, and I'll talk about that more in a minute. Assignments all are going to be submitted by 11.59 that night. So that gives you the whole entire day and evening in case you need help to contact Mrs. Rice or to have someone else help you, such as a parent, parent or a guardian, grandparent, whoever that may be. And you can upload that by 11.59 that night. The final thing that I want to let you know about is um, Re Read 180 just recently updated. And as of now, just as a head up for you kiddos, I am able to view a report that tells me exactly how long you are on a session. So if you say that you are on for 20 minutes for a session, it may not actually be what shows up here. And then I'm going to know that your time is not matching up to what you're telling me you're doing. So this is to hold you accountable. So if your log says you were on for 20 minutes, but over here, it says that you were only on the session for 10 minutes, then I'm going to know that something isn't matching up. So please make sure you're being honest with that and you're actually on there for at least 20 minutes. Okay. So let me go through and I'm going to show you here in a second. Um, Minimize that. There we go. How our schedule is going to look. So in Schoology next week, you're going to have a new setup. Let me go through this with you. So first of all, up at the top are going to be the daily logs that you're going to need. You are going to need to download those. So once again, you click on them. When you click on them, and it will look a little different in the iPad than it will on here, but you will click on this this application there will be a download button right here for you you click download it will then up at the top you can't see my screen but there will be an arrow with a circle up at the top when you click on that it will open up the different things you can choose from and the top one will be what you will want to log on this is your student app daily log you will complete this every wednesday thursday and friday and then turn it in on friday by midnight the same thing goes for your independent reading log Okay, once again, I click on the log itself. Once that has loaded in Schoology, and I would recommend using the web browser version as opposed to the app for many different reasons, but this is one of them. Then you're gonna click the download button. It will go up into your downloads. You will click on it and op it will open for you. Make sure you save these and then you can upload them on Friday. Okay, so you'll be completing this for Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday of each week. All right, so let's go back for a minute. Now, in each day, there's a couple of things that have changed. So once again, um, I have each folder and I have a little checklist right here for you of what you need to complete for each of those days. So every single day, you're going to complete a do now. This is the same types of do nows that we do in class every single day. Now you're going to do one every day at home. Then you're going to, on Mondays and Tuesdays, log on to my Zoom call, complete two pages of the workbook and submit those pages. 
Okay, so let's look what that looks like. So when I go into Monday's folder, I have the agenda here as well if you would like to see it in a bigger version. When I click on the Do Now Assessment, it's you're going to answer one question. It's the same as we've always done where you're going to have in parentheses a vocab word. You are then going to have to insert into the sentence and add to the sentence. This is going to be worth five points just like it is in school. So make sure you complete that with a capital letter and a period. Make sure all your spelling is correct. Make sure your punctuation is correct. Make sure it makes sense. You will also see here I have the link all ready to go for the Zoom. So all you'll have to do is click on this link and then it will log you in to the Zoom meeting. We'll have those at 8.30 on Mondays and Tuesdays. You will also then see I have the workbook pages here. They download just like the logs do. You will open them up, you will download them, you will save it, you will actually write on them. Now, if you join the Zoom call, Mrs. Rice is gonna go over this with you and it'll be ready to go and easy for you. Once you are done for the day with that, then you will click on this assignment and you can tell it's assignment because it has a little blue box with a pencil. So when I click on the assignment, yours will look different than mine, but it says to upload your real book pages by 11.59 p.m. and you will hit submit and you will upload those, okay? That is how Monday and Tuesday will go of each week. Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, you will be doing a completing a do now assessment, then doing 20 minutes of software, recording it, doing 20 minutes of reading and recording it. And then on Friday, let me go into the Friday folder. On Friday, there are two assignments here for you and that's where you will upload your logs. Okay, so that is everything that you need. Now, one last thing that I want to show you that I've created, and I'm going to send this to you as well, is the schedule. So this is a little small to see here. I can zoom in on it and you'll be able to see this as well. So I've given you a day by day schedule as well to hold on to. So today you're doing software and reading. Tomorrow we don't have school. Thursday, Friday, software and reading and submitting your logs on Friday. Next week, I tell you exactly what to do. Monday and Tuesday, do now, Zoom call, real book pages. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, you're going to be doing a do now assessment next week and completing your software and reading. The one last thing I wanna show you is I have us through Thanksgiving break. So on Monday the 23rd and Tuesday the 24th, you will be completing a do now, Zoom call, and completing pages. The last thing that you'll need to see is on Wednesday. On Wednesday, this is going to be a catch-up day. So I'm going to be sending an email next week telling you, hey, this is what you're missing. Some of you are missing quick writes. Some of you are missing quizzes for independent reading. Some of you might have some assignments that are missing that you haven't submitted while we're at home. So that's going to be your catch-up day. If you get everything done on time and you don't have anything to catch up on, then that day is going to be an extra day for you to enjoy in my class. So your goal and motivation is to get everything done before that day so then you have nothing to do on that catch-up day, which is an early dismissal day anyway, so we weren't going to do too much. Okay, so that's going to be the setup and the schedule for you. I will send out reminders. I will have reminds set up to go. This is all laid out for you in Schoology. It will publish next week, so you'll be ready to go. But if you have any questions, you can send me an email. You can send me a remind message, or you can even message me on Schoology. All right, guys, that's all I have for you. Thank you for listening. And as always, ask me if you have any questions. Bye.